Hello everyone, in today's video I'll be showing you how to manually install games with Aurora. First thing we want to do is press the start button, go over to content, make sure you have a path added to wherever you store your disk based games. If you have not done so, click add, click change, go down to that storage device where they're saved, and select your games folder. After that, you can Click save and then verify that you see your path added. Now insert the disk of your choice that you want to install. Today I'll be doing Star Wars Episode 3. Press the back button, go to File Manager, go back to that same storage device in that games folder. Inside here, create a new directory name this the name of the game that you are installing now go down to that folder and open it press RB go over to DVD a cool trick is here hold down X and go down with your left thumbstick to select everything on the left side, go down to copy, press LB, go to the left side, press A on paste, and select yes. This will take a second, so I'll just do a time lapse, and as soon as it's done, I'll come back. Now that the game has been completed, we can completely back out of this. To get the game to show an Aurora, there's two options we can do. We can press the back button and go to restart. In the top right, once the Aurora dashboard reboots, you'll see a scan for content text. Or we can press the start button, go to content, and then just manually select scan now. Now you see scanning for content is shown at the top right. This is going to take a second, so again, I'm going to do another time lapse, and then I'll be back. As you can see, the game now appears. A good thing to know is that if the cover art is gray, make sure you are connected to the internet, and then press the start button, and click for update assets, click download. Or if you have an internet connection, you can click scan now, either one. But thank you all for watching. 